Why do they keep sending freaking smoking cars at me? I don't understand the reasoning. Saw a sniper. Oh, shit. He rushed. Did not expect that. I'm behind the car, eh? Go away. Yeah. Sit down, punk. That's what you get for hiding. Oh, hello. Let's go around this just to make sure I don't get snuck up on. More Ingram ammo. Oh, yeah. What a jerk. I got you. Oh man, this is gonna be difficult. Oh, I got him. Yeah. Can never have too many painkillers. Okay, let's keep moving here. Wait for guys to jump around the corner like per usual. What the hell are you made out of? Oh, I have no ammo. Ah! Pump action. Shot. Man. Oh, what's he got there? Oh no. Ah, that worked out fairly well. What is this? The jackhammer. Okay, let's try this. Got that traitor son of a bitch. He's dead. God, that was intense. Okay. Added more ammo for my jackhammer. Let's go around. Okay, I don't like how this is going. Can I not burn him? Oh my god. I'm gonna snipe through your ass. Actually, I'll make a beeline towards that uh, ammo. Or, oh, sorry, health. Just to play it safe. Can never play it too safe. Maxi, Maxi, Maxi. Come out, come out, wherever you are. You yep. know, I really hate people who refuse to see the inevitable. How the hell do you get there? Oh. To do the smart thing. <sighs> gotcha. Is that it? 
payphone started to ring. Yeah. Thanks, Payne. Whatever does it for you. This is Alfred Wooden. I can give you the name of your enemy. Come to the Asgard building presently. We are expecting you. <laughs> Very anticlimactic death for him. Anyways, chapter 5. In the land of the blind. Woden was waiting for me on the steps of the old building. Mr. Payne, let's go inside. The others are anxious to begin. The others? Despite the general misconception, this building actually predates the city hall by two years, as being the oldest municipal building still in use here at the foot of the Brooklyn Bridge. No kidding. The old man played tour guide as he led me through a dark, domed hall. The answers I was after loomed large ahead. Mr. Payne, I would like to introduce you to my colleagues in what we call the Inner Circle. You've been watching too much X-Files. You have seen the files on Project Valhalla. We can fill the gaps, provide you with the information missing from those files. We were all involved in the early stages of the project during the Gulf War. What's the catch? We would very much like to blow this thing wide open, but our hands are tied. Her name is Nicole Horn. She was the key figure in Project Valhalla. When the funding was discontinued, she simply refused to quit. She knew exactly what she had in her hands. Nicole Horn is the president of Acer Corporation. She has more than half the city in her pocket. This must be kept under wraps. If you try to go public with this, we will deny any knowledge. We need you to take her out. Afterwards, we can protect you. Make all the charges go away. That was the cue for the killer suits to kick in the doors and swarm inside. There goes my out. Acknowledged. Target escaped. Last compound location. Courtyard. Search and destroy. Boo. Ah. Oh no. Shit. Oh, what the hell? What's that all about? How the hell did that even happen? Did someone throw a grenade at me? Oh, I shot an M79, that's what happened. I thought that was a pump action. like no ammo on that at all. Oh shit. I don't know why I didn't use bullet time there, but okay. Thank you for the Colt Commando ammo. Great. Snipers. Man, freaking fantastic. At least he didn't see me. One of the monitors showed what was left of the inner circle. Oh shit. That's what the condom said. so-called corpse of Alfred Woden stood up. 
miraculously waking from his dirt nap, looking smug among his dead pals. In the land of the blind, the one-eyed man is king. I didn't know how he pulled it off, but it was a pretty slick way to get out of all his promises. Most of what he had said fit too well to be a load of crap. Okay. Shit. So many freaking doors. Whoa. Oh shit. Man, shotgun, bro. Maltovs. He burned himself, I think. Keep dancing around like this. Nope. Access is denied. Yeah, okay. Oh, <laughs> drop down like it's Mission Impossible or something. Don't think so. Really? Getting death from above. Come on. Oh, no tricks this time? Get some info. He's swimming in the pills now, man. Just swimming in them. <laughs> Cubicles. Was that English? Someone please tell me how the hell am I Good thing I have an extra. I don't know how we're just get over that without. Oh, don't think so. False walls. Jackass. Radio. providing a service long overdue to the city. This crusade nonsense has gone too far. He's out of control. It must stop. He will be stopped. That was Deputy Chief Jim Rivera from the New York City Police Department. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna freaking get blown up out of nowhere. Like one bad turn. Seventy nine ammo. Add a grenades, shit. More bullet time. Needs more Colt Commando ammo as well. The videotape lay on the desk. Should I play it? Nicole Horn had blackmailed the inner circle into silence. The tape came with a curt extortion note on a piece of expensive paper. 
I remembered Candy Dawn taping her clients in action on the side, selling the tapes to the highest bidder. I was sure that kinky sex was nowhere near Alfred Woden's worst sin. But I had a feeling that when this was over, any collateral would come in handy. Okay, we got a sex tape now. Where's Paris Hilton when you need her? Wouldn't it left me a present. What? Woden had taken care of my mission preps with military precision. The critical areas in the Acer Corporation headquarters blueprints were circled in red. The president's office was at the top of the building, right below her penthouse suite. The elevators were controlled by a security computer, part of the mainframe located underground below the building. The high-rise was sealed as tight as a sci-fi fortress. So, how are we gonna get in? Is that my exit?